Hi, Rain. Hi. Are you ready to go bye bye? Yeah. You ready to go shopping? Yeah. Again? Yeah. You want to do more shopping? Yeah. Where's your sister? Um, over there. What's wrong with her? Um, she not take picture. She don't want to take picture. Okay. Well, you take your picture, right? Yeah. All right, let's go. Yay! <laughs> and there's no intro rolling. Welcome back to day two of Vlogmas on a rich and jazzy life. And rich and jazzy life. If you are just new to our channel and you're just tuning in, please don't forget to hit that subscribe button. We're a family from, well, we're not from Atlanta, but we live in Atlanta. So if you live in Atlanta and you want to see cool Atlanta vlogs, that's a great reason to subscribe to our channel. <laughs> Definitely. Um, so it's day two. We don't have an intro. So here goes last year's intro. Hope you enjoyed last year's intro. We will get that intro done sometime this week. So in case you don't know, me and Jasmine both work full-time jobs. We have a two and a three-year-old, as you see. We don't have any daycare. We don't have any school that they go to. It's us, we alternate. So yeah, so we're tired and we just can't shoot an intro. We just got off vacation and rolled right into work. Right. So we're gonna get it done. We have the plan to get it done, but we wanted to get Vlogmas rolling anyway. So we're gonna roll out with last year's intro for a few days. So just bear with us. And again, thank you to the people who were understanding of that. And anyway, a lot of people loved last year's intro. Right, a lot of people did love last year's intro. So thank you so much for the love. And thank you for um, asking us about our trip. Our trip was fabulous. We had a wonderful so cruise. Those cruise vlogs will be coming after Vlogmas. So in January, look out for those. I don't know what's so funny. But I just got off of work. Um, remember, if you watched yesterday's vlog, you see our, that I went and picked up, well, picked up some Christmas decor, mm -hmm. and there was something there that I did not get. So I'm on my way to the store now to go pick it up. A and different one, like I'll, 20 I'll, miles away. I'll explain. <laughs> when we get there, we'll talk about I'll it. I'll talk about it. One thing I do want to say in terms of the last, um, the last intro is, what do you guys think about the song? Yeah. Do you think I should change the song from last year's intro? We were de kind of debating about that. We're leaning more towards keeping the same song. Yes. So comment yeah. below. Comment below if you want to hear a new song or keep the same song. That is a great. That's a great one. I want to hear you guys. Let's take a vote. Right. Keep the old um, intro song or get a new intro song. Okay. Let us know. So we'll be back. We gotta hit the road. So I'm in Big Lots and I'm looking around at the. Lovely decor. They have really nice stuff, guys. So, if you have a big lot in your area, I highly suggest you come and get some nice Christmas decor. Now, I called here earlier to get my Christmas tree, the angel one, and I put it on hold because yesterday when I went to the store, let me turn this around. When I went to the store um, in Roswell, if you guys are familiar with Atlanta, um, I went to Roswell and they told me that I couldn't put it on hold. I had to wait to put it on. Um, I had to wait and see if a new shipment came in. I called them eight o'clock in the morning to see if they got another one. And they were like, oh, we have to wait till tomorrow. Something told me, you know what, I'm calling back. So I called back and I was like, look, I called back later on in the day and I said, did you guys get a new shipment? They were like, oh no, we didn't get it. I was like, you know what, can I just buy the store display? So they agreed. They said, yeah, you could come and get the store display. So I said, perfect. I'll be there later. So I went to the Roswell one and I got the store display. So now I'm in coming. I called another store because I want two of the angels. I want to put it somewhere in my house. So I think two of them will look better than just one. And it's on sale for $48.75. So if you like the angels, check out your big lots in your area. See if you have the angels. And get it for your own house. It's only $48.75 right now. It's on um, sale. So right now I'm waiting for someone to bring it out from the back. 
and I'm happy I'm getting my angel tree. So beautiful, so pretty. And you see all the cute stuff. This is like all the stuff for the outside. All the stuff for inside. I already got so many ornaments, so I don't need any more ornaments. I still have not decorated the tree yet, y'all. It's coming, it's coming. <laughs> I just bought these bells from the other one. I thought they were really cute. And there she goes. I just gotta fluff it out, obviously. And look what I found. Look at these beautiful flowers. I'm gonna clip them to my tree. Not this tree, but my big tree. They're 25% off. They're 450. I love it. Obviously, if you saw our vlog yesterday, you can tell that our theme is red and silver. So, I'm excited about decorating this year. She's the beauty. My angel is coming home with me. And I have the other one. I just didn't have my camera and I couldn't record the other one that I picked up earlier. But I got it. <laughs> Cooking with Jazzy. Did you miss me? I know you did. <laughs> She's back, but for only a quick little express cooking. <laughs> I just got up for work and I went shopping and I need to make a quick little dinner for myself and my family. This portion of my video is sponsored by who? Goya. Yes, I said it. Goya. <laughs> nah, I'm just kidding y'all. I am really not sponsored by Goya, but hey, Goya hit me up. Hit me up. Cause I am using your products. One, two, and three, and four. Call a girl. All right, so tonight I'm just doing some pork chops already cleaned. My pork chops, what I clean my pork chops with is some vinegar. Okay, I soaked it in. That is how my mama taught me how to clean my chops. Okay, I have five nice center cut pork chops that I bought yesterday at Sam's Club when y'all went shopping with me. Okay, and I'm just going to season these chops. Watch me. Now, this is sofrito. Some people make it fresh. I sometimes like to buy this in a jar. I like to buy the frozen one. I only got a little bit left. And I'm going to take this and I'm going to put it over top of my pork chops. Gives it a nice seasoning. A nice taste to it. So I'm going to pour it on. And rub it on in. Now, I would highly suggest if you wasn't in the, trying to do express pork chops like me, you let this soak and marinate in overnight. Oh, these pork chops will taste even better. I love to marinate. So, <laughs> marinate. <laughs> I love to marinate overnight. So, rub it on in. Do both sides. Don't And um, take the fork and poke some holes in it. Watch. I gotta wash my hands. Okay, there you go. Just gotta clean up my little seasoning packets. I use two and a half packs of sasson for five big uh, center cut pork chops. I use just a little bit. I only had a little bit left, so but I mean I use it pretty well. It's, it's nice and seasoned. I use granulated onion powder. Um, my adobo. I got that one with. Is this with pepper? Yes, this is the one with the pepper. I like black pepper, so I add extra black pepper and the granulated garlic. So I have two grill pans here because I'm trying to cook this quick, okay? Because um, this is only going to fit three of them. So I have my all-clad um, grill pan and then I have my old KitchenAid one. This one has been for many years. So, <laughs> and I'll never turn my back on her. So if you have, I would highly suggest you guys get one of these pans because who wants to go outside and grill all the time? These pans are great. Definitely invest in one of these. I remember I got this KitchenAid one for $20 from TJ Maxx several, several years ago. But I'm sure you can find one. So I'm just gonna put a little bit of olive oil in the pan and let it sear. They are nice and hot, yes. 
and then I'm just going to place the pork chop, obviously, right on in. Oh, just going to hold. Shoot, I'm about to turn that pot off and save my oil for another thing. Because I could just wait for that, <laughs> that fish pork chop to cook. What was I thinking? Child, I'm tired. Okay, so if you want to let them sear, I say give them about mm, eight minutes on each side. I'm guessing, y'all. I'm guessing. I never really timed it, but I, I believe it's eight minutes. <laughs> okay, and now I have my water boiling. Now, if you don't have no time to be making rice and beans from scratch, Goya makes the best. When I say the best, pack rice. Makes the best pack rice. So, I would highly suggest you guys go out and find some Goya rice. They make all different variations of rices. Goya is my go-to. Good old box pack rice, box rice, however you want to call it. This is my go-to to feed my family real quick at night. So, um, well for dinner. <laughs> I'm going to put it, put a little bit of oil, just a drop, and pour the rice and beans in. So I changed my mind. I did put it in the other pan because I'm going to saute me up some onions with it. I don't know why I got a little taste for some onions. So I'm going to saute up some onions with my pork chops. And you know what? I'm also going to sprinkle because I like, I like it to have like a little vinegary taste to it. So I'm going to sprinkle a little bit, my little bit of white wine vinegar over top the chops and the onions while they're cooking. To give it that nice like pickledy taste to the onions and the vinegary taste, give it that little kick. Give it a kick. And I'm gonna do the same on the other side with a little bit I have left. Okay, okay. And the rice is cooking. And there she wrote. And I'm gonna make a I'm gonna make a vegetable. I have to decide which one. And I guess for my vegetable, I have some, um, not I guess, but I, for my vegetable, I have some garlic and oil, sauteing very low. And I'm just gonna put in a bag of frozen cut leaf spinach right into my pan. Can't do it with one hand. <laughs> okay, so the pork chops are done grilling in the grill pan with my onions a little bit of salt and pepper just a little bit of butter inside my olive oil with the spinach and garlic and this is my black beans and rice by Goya 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 and as dinner I'll show you it plated Where in the world did you come up with Mommy. that? Melody and Harmony. They're angels. Melody and Harmony. They're bringing Melody and Harmony to our home. Okay, Melody all right. Okay, I can dig it. Melody and Harmony are my girls. We didn't discuss this prior. Though. I just like them around year long. Year round, wow. Year round. Okay. Year, year round. round. Is that what I said? Year long. Okay. Mommy. So, yes. I need to dress. Okay. Rain thinks she's going to put on a Christmas dress and do all that jazz, but. Yay! No, right, not not tonight. Um, I just want to tell you guys, thank you so much for reaching out to us um, and, and being concerned with Royce. Oh, there she is. There she is. Royce is not 100%. She's feeling slightly better. She doesn't want to be in the camera today at all. She doesn't want to even be pictured or she anything. Definitely crabby. So, <laughs> very crabby, not in the mood. But she is here and she's doing a little bit better. Not as bad as she was yesterday, but she's still not 100%. So thank you all for your prayers and your well wishes. 
So um, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog, enjoyed my little bit of cooking, my little pork chop meal, um, seeing me going shopping and all that jazz. I hope you guys enjoy Vlogmas day number two. Um, stay uh, tuned for more Vlogmas. Continue to share our videos, please. Don't give us a thumbs up. Don't get to comment and do all that jazz. We really appreciate it in advance. All right, guys. Well, until tomorrow, because that's when you'll see us again. Aren't you excited? <laughs> fast, fast turnaround. <laughs> right. Until tomorrow, guys. Continue to live. A rich. And jazz.